It is a new era for the north end of the Las Vegas Strip. Some major properties have already rebranded themselves. And tonight, we're learning the SLS could be the latest to join them. 8 News Now reporter Orko Mana is on the Strip with information on those changes. Industry insiders tell 8 News Now that the SLS will be going through somewhat of a retro revamp. It's just part of the massive progress made here on the North Strip. Sources within the hospitality industry say the SLS will be rebranding itself as the Sahara, an iconic name the property once had. Commercial real estate expert Kevin Buckley says a fresh slate is exactly what the SLS needs, and the same goes for the rest of the north end of the Las Vegas Strip. Buckley says the progress on Resorts World and the rebranding of the stratosphere to the Strat are good first steps, but the most crucial change needs to happen at the former Fountain Blue, the future Drew Las Vegas. He believes that will open the door to the North Strip. And they would go further down if the, if the Fountain Blue or the Drew would be completed. I mean, there's nothing prettier than the front of the Bellagio, right? We don't have that down on the north end of the Strip. Since 2009, it sat unoccupied, even after multiple attempts at redevelopment. Developer Whitcoff finally took over. They called their redesign a fresh vision, saying, quote, We believe Drew Las Vegas is set to usher in the next generation of Las Vegas resorts. It will be unlike anything on the Strip today. Whitcoff says they have confirmed an opening date for the Drew Las Vegas in the second quarter of 2022. As far as the SLS goes, they are expected to make their big announcement later tonight. Reporting on the Strip, Orcomana 8 News. Now. Still ahead tonight.